So what is CoQ10 good for? I'm talking about coenzyme Q10. Now, what is a coenzyme? It's something that helps an enzyme. And there's a lot of different enzymes in the body that go way beyond just digestion. There are enzymes that help perform many different functions. There are proteins that are involved in all the biochemical pathways in the body from making energy to making hormones to helping you detoxify poisonous chemicals. Now, CoQ10 is found in every single cell in your body. It's an extremely powerful antioxidant, but its main job is to stabilize membranes. Membranes are outer coverings of certain things, like your cell membranes have this outer fat layer. Very, very important in holding the, um, the voltage of the cell because the cell is like a battery. Without that membrane, you wouldn't be able to hold the voltage. So it's, it's a very key part of all cells. Also, the membrane around the mitochondria, which is energy factory, needs CoQ10 to help transport electrons through this process into ATP, which is the energy currency of the body. All the lipoprotein membranes need coenzyme Q10, as in HDL, LDL, and these are just proteins that carry cholesterol through the body and then back from the body back to the liver. So CoQ10 helps stabilize membranes, especially in areas of your body which you're generating a lot of energy, okay? As in the heart, the brain, the kidney, the liver, and your muscles. So we need coenzyme Q10 because it, if you're generating a lot of energy, you're also generating a lot of free radical damage and oxidation. So CoQ10 helps to counter that. Now, here's the thing. When someone takes a statin, they completely block CoQ10. And if you're going to block this enzyme, you're going to create a lot of side effects, especially muscle damage. Okay. So if you're on a statin, you need to be taking CoQ10. Also, if you have any nutritional deficiencies, you're going to be deficient in CoQ10 because that sets you up for not creating CoQ10 in the first place. If you have inflammatory conditions and there's many different kinds, autoimmune, things like MS, diabetes, you're going to need CoQ10. So CoQ10 can help any type of heart condition. It's good for athletes that generate a lot of oxidation. It's good for people that have migraines and headaches. It's good for anyone that has chronic inflammation. If you're taking a lot of medication, it's good to take. And also it's good to prevent cancer because cancer results from a lot of damage to your DNA. And so if you're taking CoQ10, you can actually help prevent some of that damage. Before you go real quick, I have a course entitled How to Bulletproof your immune system. It's a free course. I want you to take it. And here's why. Here's you. Here is your environment. Everyone is focused on this over here, avoiding your environment. But what about here? What about strengthening your immune system? That's what's missing. This course will show you how to bulletproof yourself. And so you can tolerate and resist your environment much better by strengthening your own immune system. I put a link down in the description right down below. Check it out and get signed up today. Hey, before